Hey guys, it's Turner4590, and welcome back to Let's Play No More Heroes 2, Desperate Struggle. Uh, in the last part, uh, after I stopped recording, I fed Jean, like I said I would, so we don't have to deal with her. Uh, nothing left to do, uh, because Kimmy Howell was an optional boss, so nothing resets. Nothing, Airport 51, Ryan's Gym, nothing resets, except for Jean. I don't know why, but that's, that's just how it works. So, uh... After we beat Matt Helms, we unlocked Revenge Missions. Now, these are your assassination missions of the game. And, uh, in fact, I'll, I'll go, into, go into them right now and talk through it. Uh, now, my problem with them is that you can't redo them. Now, it makes sense plot-wise, because you're killing... The, you're going after the people that killed Bishop, so it alternates every mission. So this first mission, we're just killing lackeys. And then the next mission, the Three, boss at two, the end, or the one. big nuke, he has just a bigger health bar, uh, is one of the people that aimed the gun at Bishop. So, it makes sense you wouldn't be able to redo because you're killing actual people, actual characters that matter in the story, even though you, you never find out any of their names. Um, but... It's just annoying that you can't do them over again, and you don't get uh, money either. So, they're... Like I said, it makes sense, though. They're, it basically makes them just revenge missions. That's it. But it just sucks. Okay. Yeah, uh, I can't remember how the... Uh, it actually works for revenge mission. Oh, wait, wait, no. Don't kill them yet. Oh, it's just battery. No, I, uh, I wonder if there's any uh, major things to find in this field. Uh, probably not. That'd be a really bad design choice to make, uh, a very important item, like, uh, new decoration for your hotel in, in, in an area you can only go to once. That'd be stupid. Then again, this is No More Heroes, too. <laughs> okay, no. Uh, I can't remember how revenge missions unlock. Uh, I believe you do two revenge missions, and then that's it until you beat the next rank. Because I was thinking about it, I was thinking, do you unlock all the revenge missions at once? And I was thinking, well, that's going to be boring as shit when, uh... Okay, so there's a new revenge mission. That'll be when we take... That'll be taking on one of the uh, people that aimed the gun at Bishop. Oh, it's at the restaurant. Okay. Yeah, Travis is out for revenge! <laughs> there he is. There's one of the people. Uh... So let's kill the son of a bitch. Aw, oh, yeah. The A button didn't even pop up. I'm so, I'm so smooth. Oh, that was a fail. You can't go in between the table. Great hit detection. Goes. Collision detection. Oh, and one of them has a gun. That's just right. Probably the one who killed Fisher. Oh, no. Okay, this is really annoying. I'm getting right by a bunch of fat dudes! Uh, as soon as I get ecstasy, these guys are screwed. That that sounded it could take it really out of context, but whatever. Uh, it's not worth it to rest and move that guy. He already had one health left. Come on. No, it wouldn't let me do the killing blow. Damn it. Okay, that's really cheap. Oh, nice, kill two of them. Okay, where are the... Okay, just go after this guy. Uh, also, if you go after this guy, the mission ends immediately. See, look how much freaking health he has. It's ridiculous. Almost... Uh, however, he is susceptible to killing blows. You still... Uh, he rarely gets knocked down, but if you get a, kill a chance to use a killing blow, go for it. I'm trying to use the kill... Uh, the ecstasy. There we go. Yeah, 
and bam. Oh, that was epic. Oh, knock the mic, I'm sorry. I keep knocking the mic, I'm sorry. And I believe that's it. I don't think I, that the next two unlock after the next rank, I'm pretty sure, at least. Damn it! <laughs> okay, no, apparently not. Apparently we still got to go on. Okay, because... Uh, this is a really boring start. You get up early in the morning and you're like, okay, got to do a shitload of boring revenge missions. That you don't get any money for, but it doesn't really matter because there's nothing really to buy in this game anyway. But, hell, it gives closure for, closure for Travis, so you got to do it. I'm almost positive that we don't get all of them right at once. I'm positive because uh, I remember doing the later ones when we have the next beam katana. I just remember using the next beam katana on some of the later ones. None of them are memorable though, because it it's just baddies in a room. Uh, this one I actually remember being really cheap because they all have guns. Yeah, like that. Yeah, like that. Okay, yeah. This one's a bitch. Uh, let's find the gun shooter. Here's one of them. Yeah. Oh, okay, that is really cheap. Yeah. Uh, it, uh oh, my, my, uh, Peter just made the uh, internet is dead noise that it always makes. Uh, okay, that's really cheap. Please kill one of them. Get, oh, get, get at least one killing blow. Oh, I didn't even get a killing blow. Okay, come on. Uh, oh, oh my god, I just, I just did it. I forgot to mention, uh, I can't believe I forgot to mention this. The dark step in this game is back. It's the one where you, uh, Oh. The dark step is back. It's the one where you, uh, like, you go wing and you uh, swing around the enemy. You can do a big combo. They changed that for this game. It is now almost impossible to trigger. It's definitely not as easy to trigger as it was in the first one. So, I guess you could say the game is... You know, I wouldn't say the game is harder. It's pretty much the exact same difficulty. It's just... Makes it a little more tedious, I guess. So, I, I, I honestly don't even know how to trigger the dark step. It's like, right before, I think it's right before the enemy attacks, you have to, uh, okay. If I die, I'm gonna be really annoyed. Uh, I think it's right before the enemy attacks, you have to press the control stick in, in a certain direction. Okay, please be health. Okay. Uh, and that's really hard to do because you can't really tell what the enemies are going to do. Because, you know, it's not... The, the graphics don't don't help uh, no, seeing what the enemies are going to do. Like, combined with certain camera angles. Like, I, I'm not saying the graphics in this game are bad. I'm saying that it just doesn't work for seeing enemy attacks. Like, Skyward Sword, for instance, the reason they chose the art style was to make it very clear what attack the enemies were going to do. They were... They wanted to be... There was a big blue blips. And it just made the internet noise again. That's just great. <laughs> um... The reason they chose that art style was to make it uh, so you could easily see what the enemies were doing, how they were moving, stuff like that. Skyward Sword looks excellent, by the way. Can we get four? Okay, uh, <laughs> I want these revenge missions to end, because I have nothing interesting to talk about during them. Well, if I did them during the a later rank Possibly, you can you have to unlock them later. I wouldn't know. I, as far as I know, uh, fighting Matt Helms is what triggers it because I can't remember how I triggered it before. Just pretty sure it's Matt Helms. I could be very well wrong though. Oh, he was in midair too. Okay, this one's not nearly as cheap. And 
Yeah. Go crazy. Oh, nice. I got like five killing blows there. Oh, and frame rate drop. Yeah. When there's lots of blood on screen, it does that. But the, the same happened in No One One, so. No biggie. Yeah. My biggies with this game pretty much just deal with how they handle the story a little bit, so. But I'll talk about. Oh, wait. No. Oh, come on. There are freaking presents that you can find. Well, that's really cheap, because you only get one chance to find them. I probably missed one of them then already. Okay, and. Overkill. Yeah, so the, the people that killed Bishop have huge flippin' health bars. Pretty annoying, actually. Please tell me that's it. Because I want to go I want to go to the next rank. The next rank is terrible, but it's better than Rent of Revenge Mission. Come on. Okay. Okay, so we got four revenge missions. Okay, and that's it. Okay. Uh... Wow. So an entire part is just doing boring revenge missions. That's just great. Uh... Okay. Well... I, there's nothing left to do, so let's tackle the next rank. It's rank, uh, 23. Uh, her name's Chloe Walsh, and it's at Akashic Point number 2. They they belt out Akashic Point 1 and 2 right away, and then they wait to point, belt out Akashic Point 3. I won't spoil what rank... Akashic Point 3 is, but if you just listen to my commentary so far, you'll guess what rank it is, because it's rank... Uh, blank. And you know, you already know what it is. Uh, without further ado, let's take the bitch down.